what's up guys welcome back to my channel so today we have all mine by day uh, so we got to keep on the first trade to avoid one bar card we had uh, not one but uh, we had three bar cards we had three cards uh, three bar bar cards just to put the keep on the first trade there really three open cards so let's get started keep on, on the first trade don't need to worry about the structure of the song you can actually check out the playlist where i just got three songs of day covered uh, so you can just learn if you just want to learn another song by day so have a look at the cards and then we're just gonna look at the rhythm and chord progression. The first chord A minor which is mute open second second first open. And then we have a F which is one three three two one one. You can play it like this, like this, one three three two one one. You can just play three two one one. Having problem with a lot of the bar cards, feel free to drop a comment down below. I'll like to provide you with one of my videos showing you how to master the bar cards in just ten minutes. So next chord we have is a G major which is 3, 2, open, 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 3. And that's basically everything. So the song is less than a minute so it's obviously pretty easy to play the same thing going through the whole song. So the chord progression A minor, then F, then a G. A minor goes for one bar which means 1, 2, 3, 4. And F and G goes for another bar which means 1, 2, 3, 4. One. Let me say 2, 3, 4. F, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, F two three four one two three four F two three four A minor two three four. Now let's have a look at the rhythm. I just pick. I hold the A minor chord. I play the E string open. And after that, I just try the str strum. It's a bit hard, so I just pick the bass note E string open. Then I do a strum. Now, I likely just want to strum the A string, D string, and G string. If you strum the B and I E string by mistake, that's completely okay. But still, I like just to get that flavor of the song, I just like to strum till the G string. So you got. And after that, I play the F major chord. I do one down, again strumming from E to all the way down till the G string. You don't need to play the high E string and B string for the song. I do one down. I and after doing the down, I just let that everything get muted, and I do two muted down over there. So after that, I move on to the G major chord. I repeat the exact same thing which I did for the G uh, for the F major chord. So we got two. So we got one, two. So keep on over here is to always keep your hand moving in. It's kind of very easy guys, you can actually just go with the whole song, I told you this, very s small song, obviously less than a minute, so you can just try out this, so. And that's almost everything you need for the song guys. So if this helps you, make sure to like one of these and subscribe, guys. Why do I have to tell that in all of my videos? Make sure you hit the subscribe button because I just want to reach 2,000 subscribers as fast as possible. You can check out my channel and see how much work I'm actually doing. You can check many other titles. I'm actually done with almost all the songs which comes out recently. Drop a comment if I miss any other song, and I'll see you guys back in the next video. Till then, bye.